Welcome guys, this is HON and we're gonna be making some realistic location maps for Unturned. Basically it will be a map from a real location from around the world. So what you wanna do is look for a location that you think is very much more you are that you are interested in, right? And I'm gonna just look for one right. First, you need to have a Google Earth and you need to have a site which I will put in the description below. What I'm looking for is basically terrain. And then do some good terrain that can be used for the hike. Because that's what Unturned use to show terrains. So I'm just gonna use this location. So basically, Google Earth has nothing to do with it, but unless you wanna look for a specific location. If you already know a specific location that you wanna do type map with, you could just do it. I'll use around this area. Sorry, I'll be real. Yeah. Okay, once you have done that, you can easily close that off and you can choose on this website which i will put the link below the exact um, area you want to use and then you click begin search and it will indeed crop out the location that you have chosen Basically, this location didn't come out right, but let's just see how we can work with it. So I'm gonna download one of these. I think this one looks a bit more accurate. Um, I think I should do that. Level. So let's go back, and I think I'll choose somewhere else just to. Make This one looks a bit, a bit more better, so I'm just gonna use that. You can download different ways, HTTP, FTP, doesn't really matter. So this is gonna take a, a little while to download. It's 8 megabytes, mind you, is pretty shitty right now. So I'm just gonna pause that. When it's done, I'll get back to you guys. So this took a while. Actually, the first one failed for me for some reason, but the other has worked. Okay, so I'm just gonna show in folder, open that up, and it should be below here. Okay, so let's forget about it for a while. So every dot I clicked on the on the image search it gives me a piece of that island. Okay, so, okay, so what you're gonna need next is to open that extracted actually. Open that up. So that's basically the image you need, the TIF image, which you are gonna use the microdem software to open which I will also put a link in the below the description. And here it is right there, that's how it looks. The little icon there. Rainbowish kind of color. It's called Microdem. And we're gonna X these things out. No. 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 That's if in case it, it asks you that. 
and then we're gonna look for file we're gonna open open them that you want because the rest would be C area so you want to crop it out small enough once you have done that you want to look for uh, display um, parameters and you want to click elevate once you click elevate you're gonna make it a grayscale and you click OK all you need to do and then save it you can save them save the image you want to save it as pink and I'm gonna put it in my unturned folder it's program files right and I just can't see it where is it there it is. Okay, so I'm gonna look for um, Steam. Steam should be in S and let's get a look at it. Steam apps. Help me out guys, I can't see it. Okay, I got it. Come on. Unturned. You wanna put it in your unturned maps and I have different dev map dev tests which you cannot edit. You have the map that you have created. Once you have created a map, just name it size make sure it's about I think it's 500 and something times 500 and something is the best um, the smallest map and it's basically the best to use when it comes to this and I'm just gonna put that in terrain see I already have a height map there but so I'm just gonna rename it just put any concepts in it basically and you can save it there as height map alright doesn't make sense but yes and that's all you basically need to do with this now you can close that and you can close that and close that and we're gonna open on turn okay so now that on turn is open make sure that you have on turn 3.0 3.3 early preview okay so that's the only way you could edit it because that's the only one in the editor and I placed it in Dominical Rumble I think and you're just gonna edit that you see it's 512 meters times 512 meters or miles I think okay whatever it is and we are um, <clears throat> open that and you will see that the map is basically black because why I have not edited it out to fit the right proportion so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna show you guys why you need to edit it out before you um, go to um, the on editor so what you need to do is put it into um, Photoshop or any one of the softwares like game or Paint, Paint Plus, for that matter. And all you need to do is just click Save. In Photoshop CS6, um, we actually need to click Save for Web. So you could resize it. And you want to resize it to 65 times 65 because that's the size height maps is ready now um, on turn. So it's going to be pretty much small. All you want to do is just save it, override the file, and replace it. And that's all you need to do. And you're going to close that off. It's now a small little image. Now you can open back up um, one turn. Just going to get that. I feel my games library. To the workshop. Back to the workshop editor. Okay.
now the map has the, the terrain that it's actually supposed to have. Now it's looking black and all we all need to do is click terrain. We wanna click materials. Gonna move some grass. The height if it has 17. Because sea level is 16. Fake material. It's gonna look pretty funny. That's actually how it looks. See the piece of island out there, which is in the same picture that I, I saved the, the map. And that's pretty much how you do it. Thanks for watching guys. Please subscribe and I'll have more tutorials for you guys and more gameplays. I just reached um, 100 subscribers and I'm pretty um, happy right now. So yeah, thanks for watching.